Good morning, boys and girls. It's Mrs. Vincent, and I am here to present to you for Character Week. And the character that we all know and love, um, I think this is a familiar story for a lot of friends, but this is If You Give a Mouse a Cookie. So we've been talking about characters, the people or animals sometimes that are in our story. So I get to present to you today, if you give a mouse a cookie, and I want to thank Mrs. McLean for letting me borrow this book so that I could read it to you myself. Um, and this author is Laura Numeroff, illustrated by Felicia Bond. I'm actually gonna take that book jacket off, make it a little easier for myself. If you give a mouse a cookie, If you give a mouse a cookie. He's going to ask for a glass of milk. When you give him the milk. He'll probably ask you for a straw. When he's finished, he'll ask for a napkin. He looks pretty happy down there. Then he'll want to look in a mirror to make sure he doesn't have a milk mustache. When he looks into the mirror, he might notice his hair needs a trim. That one lone little hair. So he'll probably ask for a pair of nail scissors. When he's finished giving himself a trim, he'll want a broom to sweep up. He'll start sweeping he might get carried away and sweep every room in the house. You can see the mess that he made over there. It wasn't that one hair he needed to trim. He did make quite the mess. He may even end up washing the floors as well. When he's done, he'll probably want to take a nap. You'll have to fix up a little box for him with a blanket and a pillow. He'll crawl in, make himself comfortable, and fluff the pillow a few times. He'll probably ask you to read him a story. They used a beauty powder box, and that's what he's fluffing up. <laughs> So you'll read to him from one of your books and he'll ask to see the pictures. I'll show you that nice and close. When he looks at the pictures, he'll get so excited. He'll want to draw one of his own and he'll ask for paper and crayons. And there he jumps up ready to draw his own picture. He'll draw a picture. When the picture is finished, he'll want to sign his name. That is quite a beautiful picture. It's a really good example of our illustrator's skills. With a pen, then he'll want to hang his picture on your refrigerator, which means he'll need Scotch tape. He'll hang up his drawing and stand back to look at it. Looking at the refrigerator will remind him that, there you can see all of those, he's getting the scotch tape. And this is the little tower he has to create in order to be able to reach the refrigerator. Cause remember he's a tiny little mouse. He's thirsty. So, not at all dramatic, right? <laughs> I'm sure many of you can relate to that. He'll ask for a glass of milk. And chances are, if he asks for a glass of milk, make your prediction, he's going to want a cookie to go with it.
Thank you so much for joining me on another one of our character uh, days activities. If you give a mouse a cookie, make sure that you check out the math video that's attached with this. And I've got some really fun ideas to go along with this story. Until next time. Bye friends.